Today, we stand at the threshold of an exciting adventure, not into the unknown, but deep into the core of our most known selves. We are here to unravel the power and absolute necessity of personal development, a journey not measured in miles or years, but in wisdom, growth, and fulfillment. Now let me ask you, what does it mean to develop yourself to your best? It's a question that might seem straightforward at first glance, but when we pause and truly consider it, the depth of its meaning begins to unfold. It's not just about achieving success in our careers, accumulating wealth, or even mastering new skills. Though these are undoubtedly valuable pursuits, it's about something more profound, more enduring. It's about tapping into our latent potential, challenging our boundaries, and rising above the ordinary to embrace an extraordinary life defined by our highest aspirations and dreams. Developing yourself to your best is about becoming the architect of your destiny, sculpting your character, capabilities, and course in life with intention and purpose. It's about growing stronger, wiser, and more resilient in the face of challenges and more compassionate, understanding, and supportive in the presence of other struggles. It invites us to ask ourselves, am I living my life in a way that brings out my highest potential, or am I merely existing? As we dive into this topic today, let's embark on a collective quest to uncover the essence of personal development and the transformative power it holds. Let's explore how we can each embark on this vital journey not just as solitary travelers, but as a supportive community, encouraging and inspiring one another to reach heights we might once have thought unattainable. Today, I want to talk about something that lies at the very heart of success, fulfillment and happiness. I'm here to talk about the power and necessity of personal development. Now, let me pose a thought-provoking question. What does it mean to develop yourself to your best? Is it about acquiring new skills, expanding your knowledge, or perhaps improving your financial status? While all these aspects are important, developing yourself to your best transcends beyond mere external achievements. It's about cultivating a mindset geared towards continuous growth, embracing change, and relentlessly pursuing excellence in every facet of your life. Imagine for a moment a version of yourself free from the constraints of past mistakes, unfazed by the fear of the unknown, and unbound by the limits society often places on us. This version of you is not a distant reality, but a possibility that awaits at the threshold of personal development. It's about becoming the architect of your future, where every day presents a new canvas to paint your masterpiece. Now let's dive into the significance of constantly striving for personal improvement. The journey towards personal growth is not a race, but a marathon, a continuous quest that unfolds with every step we take. The beauty of personal development lies in its transformative power, how it molds us into better versions of ourselves, bit by bit, day by day. It's about recognizing that we are works in progress and that every day presents an opportunity. Let me share a story that beautifully illustrates this point. There was once a young man who aspired to become a renowned artist. Day and night, he toiled, perfecting his craft, yet he felt something was missing. One day, an accomplished painter visited his studio and observed his work. The young artist eagerly asked for feedback, hoping for praise. Instead, the experienced painter pointed out several areas for improvement. Initially disheartened, the young man decided to view the feedback as a gift, a roadmap towards excellence. He dedicated himself to refining his skills, focusing on one area at a time. Years later, his art adorned the walls of galleries worldwide, a testament to the power of incremental improvements. This story serves as a powerful reminder that greatness is not achieved overnight. It's the result of consistent effort, resilience, and an unwavering commitment to personal growth. Each one of us holds within an untapped reservoir of potential waiting to be unleashed. The path ahead is filled with endless possibilities, and the pursuit of personal development is the key that unlocks the door to these opportunities. As we embark on this journey together, I encourage you to reflect on your potential, to dream big, and to view every challenge as a stepping stone towards your ultimate goal. 
remember, the pursuit of personal development is not just about reaching a destination, but about enjoying the journey, savoring each moment of growth, and embracing the person you become along the way. Ladies and gentlemen, as we delve deeper into the essence of personal growth, let us keep in mind that the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. And that step taken today can lead you to unimaginable heights tomorrow. Let's embrace the journey of personal development, for in it lies the key to unlocking our... Now, I want to turn our attention inward to the vast landscapes of our own potential. You see, within each of us lies a treasure trove of unique talents, strengths, and capabilities, many of which remain untapped like undiscovered veins of gold beneath the Earth's surface. The question I pose to you today is, have you truly explored the depths of your potential? Or better yet, do you believe in the boundless possibilities that lie within you? Let me share with you a story that beautifully underscores the idea that it's never too late to discover and harness your potential. This is the story of a woman named Susan. For most of her life, Susan worked in various administrative roles. She was good at her job, reliable, yet she always felt that something was missing. Deep down, she harbored a love for painting, a passion she had set aside since her youth, considering it an impractical pursuit. Years went by, and the voice inside her, the one urging her to pick up the brush again, grew louder. Finally, at the age of 52, after watching an inspiring documentary on late bloomers, Susan decided to enroll in a local art class. She felt out of place at first, surrounded by younger, seemingly more talented students. But she persisted, driven by a newfound purpose. Susan's journey was not without its challenges. She battled self-doubt, criticism, and the daunting task of balancing her job with her passion. Yet, with each stroke of the brush, she felt more alive, more herself than she had in years. Her dedication paid off. Slowly but surely, her skills improved. Her paintings began to attract attention, first from her classmates, then from her instructors, and eventually from the local community. Three years after she first dared to rekindle her passion, Susan held her first solo art exhibition. It was a modest affair, but to her, it represented something monumental, a testament to the untapped potential that had lain dormant within her for so long. Susan's story is a powerful reminder that our potential does not wane with age. It does not diminish with the passing of time. Rather, it waits patiently for us to seize it, to nurture it, and to let it flourish. Each of us has our own painting waiting to be brought to life, our own unique contribution that can make the world a richer place. So I ask you, what is your painting? What talents and dreams have you pushed aside? Remember, the realization of your potential is limited only by your willingness to pursue it. The key lies in taking that first step, in believing that it is never too late to change course and embrace the person you were meant to become. Let Susan's story inspire you. Let it be a reminder that no matter where you are in life, your potential is waiting to be unlocked. The journey to discovering and realizing your potential may not be easy. It will require courage, perseverance, and resilience. But I promise you it will be worth it. In our exploration of reaching our fullest potential, let's talk about an essential tool in our arsenal, one that acts as the compass guiding us through the vast seas of opportunity and challenge alike. This tool, my friends, is the art of setting goals, the very blueprint of success that each of us can design. Imagine for a moment embarking on a road trip without a map or a destination in mind. You might enjoy the freedom of the open road for a while, but soon, you'd likely find yourself wandering aimlessly, wasting precious time and fuel. In life, as on the road, having a destination, a clear and compelling goal, is what gives our journey direction purpose and meaning. Now, let's delve into how we can set these goals effectively. You've probably heard of the SMART criteria, a simple yet powerful framework that ensures our goals are clear, measurable, and achievable. SMART stands for Specific, Measurable, Achievable, Relevant, and Time-Bound. Let's break it First, be specific. Your goal should be as clear as a bell. Instead of saying, I want to be successful, 
define what success looks like to you. Is it starting your own business, writing a book, or perhaps running a marathon? Second, ensure it's measurable. How you know when you've achieved your goal. If your aim is to improve your health, set a measurable goal, such as losing a certain number of pounds or running a specific distance. Third, your goal must be achievable. It should stretch you, but remain within the realm of possibility. Dream big, but stay grounded in reality. Fourth, make sure it's relevant. Your goal should align with your values and long-term objectives. It should feel important to you, filling you with a sense of purpose and excitement. Lastly, it must be time-bound. Set a deadline. This creates a sense of urgency propelling you forward and keeping procrastination at bay. To illustrate the power of goal setting, let me share the story of Catherine, a young woman who dreamed of becoming an astronaut. From a young age, Catherine set her sights on the stars. She understood the importance of setting clear, achievable goals. She broke down her monumental dream into smaller, manageable objectives. See? Excelling in her studies, earning a degree in aerospace engineering, and gaining experience in the aviation industry. Each goal was a stepping stone bringing her closer to her ultimate dream. Years of hard work, determination, and relentless pursuit of her goals paid off when Catherine was selected for astronaut training. Today, she's a symbol of what's possible when we dare to dream big and meticulously chart the course to make those dreams a reality. Catherine's story, like many others who have achieved remarkable success, underscores the transformative power of setting goals. It reminds us that our dreams, no matter how lofty, can be broken down into a series of steps, a blueprint that guides us from where we are to where we aspire to be. So I challenge you today to think about your own blueprint for success. What goals will you set for yourself? How will you ensure they guide you towards the life you've always dreamed of? Remember, the act of setting a goal is the first step in turning the invisible into the visible. It's the first stroke of pain on the canvas of your life. The first note in the symphony of your greatest achievements. Set your goals with intention. Follow them with passion. And let them be the beacons that light your way to greatness. In the symphony of our aspirations, persistence plays a melody so profound that its echoes can be heard in the hallways of history, in stories of triumph that remind us of the boundless power of the human spirit. It's the force that pushes us to stand up. One more time, when we've been knocked down, the whisper that encourages us to take one more step when the path seems insurmountable. The role of persistence in personal development cannot be overstated. It is the bridge between setbacks and success, the ingredient that turns ordinary individuals into legends Consider for a moment the story of Michael, a young athlete with dreams of becoming a world champion. Michael's journey was anything but easy. He faced not just the physical challenges of his sport, but financial difficulties that almost ended his career before it began. Injury after injury seemed to conspire against him, each one a voice telling him to give up, to accept that maybe his dreams were just that. Dreams. But Michael chose a different path. He chose to listen to the voice of persistence, the one that told him, your story isn't over yet. Every morning, Michael woke up with a single purpose to be better than he was the day before. He trained relentlessly, using each failure as a lesson, each setback as a stepping stone. His persistence paid off when, against all odds, he won his first national championship. That victory was more than a medal. It was proof that persistence could turn even the most distant dreams into reality. Michael's story is not unique. History is replete with tales of individuals who face seemingly insurmountable obstacles but never gave up. These stories teach us an invaluable lesson. Failures are not roadblocks but stepping stones. Each one is an opportunity to learn, to grow, and to come back stronger. Now you might wonder, how can we cultivate this indomitable spirit of persistence? The first step is to redefine our relationship with failure. Instead of seeing it as a signal to stop, view it as a sign that you're pushing the boundaries of your abilities, that you're truly striving toward your potential. 
Remember, the road to success is paved with failures. Each one is a testament to your courage to pursue your dreams. The other key is to break your journey into smaller, manageable goals. Persistence is easier to maintain when you can see progress, however small. Celebrate each achievement, each step forward as a victory in its own right. These small wins will fuel your motivation and reinforce your commitment to your larger vision. Let me leave you with a thought. Persistence is not just about the capacity to endure, it's about having the courage to begin again, smarter and stronger than before. It's about believing in your dreams, even when they seem out of reach. It's about holding on to hope, even in the face of despair. So to everyone listening, I say this, embrace persistence as your companion on the journey of personal development. Let it guide you through the darkest nights and into the dawn of your greatest achievements. Remember, it's not the swiftness of the journey that matters, but the resolve to continue, the determination to never give up. In persistence lies the power to transform your dreams into your destiny. Let us all strive to embody this virtue, for in it lies the key to unlocking our fullest in this ever-evolving tapestry of life, change is not just inevitable. It's the wind beneath the wings of growth and development. It's the architect of character and the molder of destinies. The importance of being adaptable in the face of change cannot be overstressed. It's the quality that allows us to navigate the turbulent waters of life, to turn challenges into opportunities, and to emerge from the crucible of experience not just unscathed, but fortified. Imagine, if you will, standing on the shores of your life, watching the waves of change roll in. You could either fear the tide, retreating further inland, or you could learn to surf, to ride the waves of change to new and uncharted territories of your potential. Embracing change is not merely about survival. It's about thriving. It's about recognizing that each wave brings with it the seeds of growth and the promise of new beginnings. Consider the story of Elizabeth, a seasoned executive at a leading technology firm. For years, she thrived in the stability and predictability of her role. But the winds of change began to stir. The industry evolved rapidly, and suddenly, Elizabeth found herself facing technologies and strategies that were alien to her years of experience. The comfort zone she had built was no longer a fortress, but a cage. Instead of resisting the change, Elizabeth embraced it. She embarked on a journey of learning, not just to acquaint herself with the new technologies, but to master them. She attended workshops, sought mentorship, and dedicated herself to personal development. Her adaptability became her strength, transforming her from a seasoned executive to a visionary leader capable of steering her company into the future. Elizabeth's story underscores a vital truth. Embracing change is crucial for growth and development. It requires us to be flexible, to let go of outdated beliefs and practices, and to open ourselves to new experiences and ideas. In this journey we call life, where the landscape constantly shifts beneath our feet, there's one beacon that guides us toward the pinnacle of personal excellence, lifelong learning. It's not merely an activity or a pastime. It's the very essence of growth, the fuel that propels us towards realizing our fullest potential, the importance of continuous learning in achieving personal excellence cannot be overstated. It is the cornerstone upon which the edifice of personal and professional success is built. Let's talk about cultivating a growth mindset, an essential ingredient in the recipe for lifelong learning. A growth mindset is the belief that our basic qualities are things we can cultivate through our efforts. Unlike a fixed mindset, which sees talent and intelligence as static traits, a growth mindset thrives on challenge and sees failure not as evidence of unintelligence, but as a heartening springboard for growth and for stretching our existing abilities. But how do we cultivate this mindset? It begins with staying curious, with fostering an insatiable desire to know more today than we knew yesterday, and even more tomorrow. It's about looking at the world around us with wonder and asking, why? Or why not? With the eagerness of a child. This curiosity becomes the driving force that keeps us engaged in the process of learning. 
pushing us to explore new horizons and to challenge the boundaries of our understanding. Continuing our discourse on the transformative power of continuous learning and improvement. It's imperative we delve deeper into the mechanics of weaving this principle into the very fabric of our daily lives. This journey, rich with the potential for personal evolution, challenges us to transcend the ordinary, to scale the heights of our own untapped potential. Imagine embarking on this path not as a solitary quest, but as an adventure shared with like-minded souls, each step illuminated by the light of knowledge and the joy of discovery. The road to self-improvement is paved with the stories of those who dared to dream, to challenge the status quo, and to redefine the boundaries of possibility. Among these tales, one finds a common thread, a steadfast commitment to pushing beyond comfort zones to learning and relearning amidst the ebb and flow of life's tides. Consider the story of Anna, a middle-aged professional who found herself at a crossroads. The world around her was changing rapidly, and she felt left behind, her skills becoming less relevant in the fast-paced digital age. The specter of obsolescence loomed large, a stark reminder of the relentless march of progress. But Anna chose not to succumb to fear or resignation. Instead, she embraced the challenge, Viewing it as an opportunity to reinvent, Anna's journey was not without its hurdles. She grappled with self-doubt with the daunting task of balancing work, family, and her educational pursuits. Yet, her resolve did not waver. She enrolled in online courses dedicating her evenings to study, her weekends to workshops and seminars. Each module completed, each certificate earned, was a testament to her determination, a step closer to her goal. But Anna's story is more than a tale of personal triumph. It is a blueprint for us all, a reminder that learning is a lifelong endeavor, one that requires not just dedication, but also a strategy. Incorporating learning into our daily routines demands more than just the allocation of time. It requires a shift in mindset, a re-evaluation of priorities, and most importantly, a commitment to action. To truly embrace continuous learning, we must cultivate habits that foster growth and development. It begins with setting aside time for reflection, for introspection to assess where we are and where we wish to go. This reflective practice allows us to identify the areas in our lives and careers that necessitate improvement to set clear, actionable goals for our learning journey. Moreover, integrating learning into our lives entails a conscious effort to seek out opportunities. It means being proactive, attending seminars, workshops and conferences, not merely as passive participants, but as active learners eager to absorb, question, and apply the knowledge gained. Yet the pursuit of learning extends beyond formal education. It encompasses the wealth of experiences that life offers, each encounter, each challenge, a lesson in disguise. It is about being open to new ideas, new ways of thinking, and being willing to challenge our preconceptions. This openness to experience is the hallmark of a true lifelong learner, one who views every moment as an opportunity to grow. Furthermore, embracing change and adaptability, as discussed earlier, is integral to this journey. The world we inhabit is a kaleidoscope of change, each shift, each turn, presenting new challenges and opportunities. And to thrive in this ever-changing landscape, we must be willing to adapt, to evolve. This adaptability is not innate. It is cultivated through a commitment to continuous learning, to staying relevant, and to anticipating the needs of the future. As we navigate the path of personal development, it is crucial to remember that we are not alone. The journey is shared with mentors, with peers, and with the countless individuals who have walked this path before us. Their wisdom, their experiences, serve as beacons Oops. guiding us through the fog Cities of Cities can leverage the collective expertise, resources, the road ahead is long and the journey tip, is complex, 
filled and with creativity and of diverse with stakeholders to address complex environmental challenges and create no more resilient, sustainable, and equitable urban environments. Best versions of ourselves, a step toward a future bright with promise and limitless potential.